Thank you for visiting our channel. Today I came out to review this beautiful docking station. This is not just docking station, it will do more. So you can see that the box is nicely designed. It just have one writing in the front and we will flip it around. There's nothing there. Once we open it, the components that are part of this is the actual docking station. And then it also comes with a power supply, which is 12 volt, 3 amps and it is a little bit big. It's created for Canada and United States and also comes with a user manual. The user manual has a lot of information in English and it will tell you exactly what you can do with this. And once you flip it on the other side is all in Chinese language. So we will put that aside and now we let's look into the docking station itself. Now I am keep calling it docking station. This is a hot swap hard drive spot and also this is going to work without connection anything to the computer. It will clone your hard drive. So you can see it's nicely designed. It has two bays on the top and it will take 2.5 hard drive which already have a little cut and if you want to hook up the 3.5 hard drives which is for your regular computers you just have to put that little part down and you can hook up hard drive too. Connections are exactly the same. So from the top you have a bunch of little icons on a site and we will show you in a few seconds what they are for but go into the front part of it you have their name and go into the right side of it there's no holes or anything there but go into the back part of it is where you're going to see the USB 3.0 connection. Also it has the DC connection which is 12 volt 3 amps and then you have the power button. Going on the other side of it, there's nothing there, but when you flip it upside down, as we're going to see four little legs so you can stand up, and also it has a little sticker. Now, going back to the front part of it, so once you connect it, you will make sure you turn on your power. So once you hook up your hard drive A, which is the back one, and then hard drive B, which is the front one, so the back one will read it, and the front one will write it. You have to hold it for three seconds and then really quick you have to press the clone button again so that way it is start going to clone it. Now this has no connection to the computer while you're cloning it. For the 200 gigabyte to be transferred it is quite fast and very easy to process. This way it's all going to be cloned. You just have to hook it up to your computer going to your BIOS and changing settings and that way it will boot for you. Except that this is also going to use as a hot swap hard drive on your computer just using the USB 3.0 and the back part of it. This is very easy thing to use and also play with. It is inexpensive. I will be placing some links in the bottom where you can order it from. Except that I hope you guys like our video. If you do like it, click the click the like button, subscribe button on the top, comment in the bottom. Always remember to visit our own website which is xctext.info, like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, Instagram and other social networking places and thank you.